So today we are training civil society organizations and women's rights groups on effective ways to engage parliaments in the legislative process and the oversight process. So over the period of the two days, today we are focusing on the legislative process. Why are we doing this? We are doing this under the auspices of, of our project, which is dubbed Inclusive Legislatures for Gender Responsive Policies. And what the project seeks to do is to support parliaments to be more responsive, more gender responsive in the passage of laws, uh, budgets, etc., taking into account the needs and interests of women, children, and vulnerable populations. And as part of that, Part of the project supports Parliament itself directly, both the administrative arm and the political arm. But also we support civil society organizations who work within the gender space, who work with women and children, to ensure that their input also finds expression in the work of Parliament. And so today, the groups that are gathered here, we are trying to take them through the best ways that they can engage Parliament, they can engage committees around lawmaking processes to ensure that as they also work with citizens groups, uh, diverse groups of women, children, persons with disability, the input they get from the grassroots would find way into Parliament's work at the central level.